All right, everybody, here we go. Welcome, everyone. I hope you guys are excited as I am because today we're going to play and stream live uh, Alan Wake 2. Um, I'm very excited to be playing this because when I was adjusting the volume to make sure everything sounds good, uh, when I heard the soundtrack, I was like, oh, it sounds terrifying and it sounds good. I love a, a horror game that has a, an awesome horror soundtrack. If the soundtrack is so terrifying for the right moment, the right atmosphere, the right mood to get you into it, to, uh, uh, to the story, the game, then that's perfect. I love it. <clears throat> Silent Hill was one of them. Resident Evil has a bunch of that. And Alan Wake 2 in the first one. But I'm very excited how this one's going to be. Some say the gameplay is great. It's more horrifying than the first one. And others say that the story is eh, not as good as the first, but still enjoyable. So I'm just going in not knowing what to expect, the, the, the story of what it's about. Uh, so yes, um, I welcome everybody. I hope you guys are excited. So let's get started, shall we? <clears throat> It's good to see that we're in the same room that uh, where we left off Alan Wake. Because remember, in part one, I wonder, are they going to do uh, flashbacks? I don't think they did. Um, but in the last game, Alan Wake was able to save his wife, but he stayed behind to continue writing the stories or to save himself from the dark, the darkness, the, the dark presence, whatever it's called. <clears throat> so he was able to save himself, but there's still a lot of unanswered questions about What's his name? Uh, Zane, Thomas Zane, uh, the Dark Presence. How are we going to destroy it? <clears throat> and Alan Wake, how is he going to escape from this nightmare? And um, some other stuff that I can't think of right now. But let's go ahead and get started. <clears throat> I'm going to do a new game because here we go. Normal, yes. Challenging combat. Wait. Challenging combat. Using items and conserving resources is required for survival will not pose a challenge focus on a mystery solving exploration no normal let's do normal back to the beginning we all come to a story with hopes and expectations looking for an answer sometimes it would be better to live with that hope without ever knowing the full story In a horror story, there are only victims and monsters. And the trick is not to end up as either. But trapped by the genre, we are all ripped to pieces along the way. This is not the story I hoped it would be. This is not the ending I wanted. This story will eat us alive. This story is a monster. And monsters wear many faces. It sounds good, huh? I like the soundtrack. I was like, ooh. <clears throat> hey, Butters. How's it going, sir? Come on in. Oh, yeah, sorry about this, guys. I figured you wouldn't mind seeing a man's butt, huh? Hey, Luffy, how's it going? Okay, hold on. I need to check something. Options are the audio. Yes, it should be all good. Okay, guys. No, I don't want to... I don't want to show the frontal area, but, but so I have no idea who this is. It seems like we're back at the Cauldron Lake. Is that what it's called? Just look at that beautiful sight. Do you guys like what I see? Oh, and the mountains too. The mountains and the clouds. Yes, very beautiful. 
Okay, I'm gonna try to keep this because we don't want to see his frontal area. Mm -mm. Not today. Why did I have to put it like that? Like the camera right there on his butt cheeks. <laughs> okay, so where are we? What are we doing? By the way, guys, if the volume of the game is too high, I would deeply appreciate, very much appreciate you letting me know that if I need to adjust it, like lower it down a little bit. Wait. Huh? I hear voices in those in the forest, in the trees. How long, are we, how long are we gonna stay like this? I hope to God when a cutscene happens, we don't see his frontal area. The graphics look pretty good. Remember the first Island Wake game? It came out, woo, long time ago. <gasps> So let's ho let's see if the wait was worth it. <clears throat> Damn, I would be. Oh, the leaves are tickling my my bum. <laughs> oh, I'm about to get passed through the. Oh. <laughs> God forbid I step on something like a sharp glass, you never you know, or something pointing goes through my foot. <laughs> oh shit! What the f stop! No! <laughs> Who is this man, by the way? Oh shit. What the hell? This is an interesting tree. Oh, and it moves. Look at that. It's like wobbling a little bit. This is my home. This is my home. I'm staying here forever. You you can sprint by. What is it? Left three. Oh, I need a bath. Am I gonna get chased or what? All right, let's go. Oh no! No way! I don't have a weapon! I'm naked! The only weapon that I have is my... My cakes. Do you think they want to eat some cake, guys? Isn't that what they call it now these days? Oh, he's, he's packing cake. He or she is packing cake. Now it's raining. Man, I'm going to get sick. <clears throat> what the fuck?
What's this? A map? Oh shit. Oh my god! Oh my god, they see me! Yes, yes! Oh my god, I'm dead! Oh god. Where's the rest of the stuff? I need to finish this. My god, I'm done. What the fuck? Shit. Do you have money? No more. That was intense. Alan, wake to Well guys, thank you so very much for joining me in this live stream of Alan Wake 2. I hope you guys enjoyed the story and the gameplay. Let's see what happens in Alan Wake Part 3. Davis, let's play your favorite game. Hell hey, no. Hey, <laughs> How are you? I'm good, Mom. How are you? This trip might take a little longer than I thought. I'm sorry I've been gone so much lately, Logan. Oh my god, Mom. It's not your fault. People get all murdery. What happened? Just work stuff. Right. Well, Dad and I are just watching the latest episode of Night Springs here. Mom, it's so good. No spoilers. No spoilers. I'll let you get back to the show. You were supposed to wait and watch with me. Spoiler patrols are on the lookout. By the way, you see the trend. Hello, Luffy. Come on in, guys. And say hi to Casey. Tell him to stop brooding so much. Logan. I will. Bye, Kale. Oh, my God. <clears throat> Logan thinks you should try cheering up. <laughs> oh, so he was there? Snarky kid. Wonder where she gets that from. Mm, okay. It can't be a coincidence that another body turns up just as we arrive in town. Feels like the killer's leaving us a message. Hmm. I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. It's right up your alley. You should take lead. Think of me as the backup. Okay. Any words of advice? Nothing that would cheer anyone up. Yeah, sorry guys, what's up? Talk to me. I'm like paying attention to the story. <laughs> Also, I'm going to quiz you guys, so you also got to pay attention. I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. What's up, guys? My bro T pose. A deputy was supposed to be here to show us to the crime scene. There's the car, so where's the deputy? <laughs> Eaten by a bear? <laughs> I'll check out that map. Ret return one. Invitation. One second. Because I think if it was someone, it'd be the hard. Oh, congrats, Luffy. I'm happy for you, man. Good job. Uh, worth memorizing oh. before we get swallowed up by the trees. My name is Anderson. Okay. Oh. 
The map displays key locations in the area. Oh. Wait, don't speak! Wait, what? I can go take a look. I never said that, Mulligan! I said we should both be down here, watching this dead guy! Quit your belly aching, Thornton. I'm up here now. I forgot just how the cookie crumbles. All right, they shut up now. So where are we? We are here, guys. We are here. Came from over there. Rental rental cabins. Bonnie leg. Wait, Bonnie. Wait, bony legged path. Okay. Came this way. <gasps> Cauldron Lake. Cauldron Lake. That's where your home in the pines. I don't think we've been here the last time. <gasps> Witches Laddle? Witches General Store? Witches Witches Hut? What is it? What is this? Hogwarts? Witchfinder Station? And why is this stream? Witches Stream? I don't know. I don't know what the hell that says. Okay, let's do this. Wait, hold on, deputy. I need to get my shotgun for this shit. Open the door, damn it. What? No motorized vehicles. Protect the trails. Hold on, I need... I want to see what's over here. Cauldron Lake. Where am I? Oh, wait, 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 wait. So I'm going this way. What? Cauldron Lake? But how come it says over there on the other side it was Cauldron Lake? Danger. The Federal Bureau of Control? That's a new one. Toxic volcanic gas, huh? What the, the hell? FBC is an obscure branch. It only shows up for unusual cases. Well, what's so unusual about volcanic gas? Beats me. Locked. They really don't want people coming in here. Oh, goals. Get to the crime scene. Find the deputies. Okay. So what's with Cauldron Lake? I was mostly lurking. So in Cauldron Lake, that's where Alan and his wife went to go stay at this cabin that was in the... That was like in this little, small, little tiny island, right? And they said that that island was placed above an old, volca uh, of old volcano that's, you know, uh, underwater. But then there were other stories that a man that also stayed, here, stayed at the same cabin with his wife, um, and that was Thomas Zane. He, uh, after everything that happened with his wife, that she died, but then he discovered the, the, the secrets and the, the, the power that the lake had or something in that area, whatever, if you like, I don't know, I guess in their case, if you're like a, a writer that has a wild and crazy imagination, whatever you think of, or you write in the story or whatever in the typewriter, it comes true. So Thomas Zane thought it would be good, a good idea to bring back his dead wife. But when he brought her back, she wasn't herself. The dark presence took, you know, used her body to come back to life, and it's a whole bunch of mumbo jumbo. It's a whole, it's a lot to explain. But that lake tends to have some special secrets, some ability, some power. Oh, and um, that's where Alan Wake stayed behind. He, his wife, he was able to save his wife, but he stayed behind. He stayed behind in the dark in the dark area, in the dark world, or whatever you call it. That's hot. Yeah, I know that I did say congratulations, Luffy, and that that's great, and I hope you had a good time. I did say that. I hope you heard me. <laughs> so what happened to his wife? Is she... one piece, Anderson. Forest can be a dangerous place. <sighs> I'm a tough girl. No need to worry about me. But then again, I'm, I suppose that's why you hired me, right? To take care of your ass? Hmm? No, um, so his wife, 
I don't know, man. They never ex- they just show that she made it out of the water, like she came back to the real world. So Alan Wake saved her. But I don't know what she did. Yeah, if I was the wife, I would have tried to figure out how can I get him back? How how can I save Alan? Because she did call for him, like Alan, where are you? And she didn't find him. So a lot. There's, like I said, that's still unanswered. Que- that's a, still unanswered question to see what did his wife do? What hey, did the town do? Oh. oh, hello. Hey there. Oh, maybe, Agent maybe. Casey, right? Sheriff Breaker said you'd be coming by to take over the case. You're half right. Anderson. Mm-hmm. I'm in charge Sergeant here. Anderson, I'll be leading this case. Seems you already know my partner, Alex Casey. Shoot. Sorry about that, ma'am. I, I'm Deputy Mulligan. I just figured that, you know, that... Uh... Where's those damn fits gonna show up, Mulligan? Oh. Federal agents right here, Thornton. <laughs> my partner, Thornton, down at the crime scene. He's not what you call the sharpest axe in the shed. Any witnesses to the crime? Wait, I could use a briefing. Uh, what can you tell us about the crime scene? Tell them about the heart. I was getting to that, Thornton. <clears throat> well, we reckon there are some uh, organs that are currently outside the victim's person when they should be, well, you know, inside. Mm-hmm. Any witnesses to the crime? Were there any witnesses? <clears throat> yeah, a couple out of towners. I wonder what they were doing sneaking around the woods at oh, night. I mentioned the city folk. It's pretty suspicious. Not that we have anything against city folk, cried Thornton. But don't worry. Sheriff Breaker took them back to town a while ago. Hmm. Let's take a look at. Let, let me take a look at the body, please, I sir. I want to see the body. How do we get there? Oh, sure, that's real simple. Just through the hole in the fence, down the hill towards the lake, around the old convenience store, you can't miss it. Everything's been closed since the area was fenced off. The store, the campground, all of it. Can you shut him up? I got it, Thornton. (laughs) Thank you very much. I reckon you get yourself a new partner. Because he sounds like a dumbass. Meet Deputy Thornton. Okay. Before we get to the crime scene, there's time to review the facts of the case so far. Make sure I'm seeing the clues clearly. Shut up, Thornton. They can still hear you. Shut up. Shut up, shut up. Well, don't you all have those radios where you press the button, then you could speak, and then turn it off? Or don't you have earphones? Because that is a little embarrassing. Unprofessional, too. They were getting Kit Kat bars. Wait, well, <laughs> because he ran out of ink. I could... So, well, then why didn't he just write, and my wife came back to life without any repercussions of evil? Because he he ran out of paper. Let me see. Hmm. I wonder if we'll get to explore some of the familiar uh, areas, like in the first game, guys. Like the asylum, the cabin... Are we gonna meet? <gasps> are we gonna meet Cynthia? I need to think through the facts of the case. Oh, you can access the case board inside the mine place. Oh, the mine place, my version of the mine palace technique, to sift through clues and work the case, building the mine place again for each case, using each field office as a model in my head. What? You can the do facts that. Are on the board. One second, girl. Let me take a look around at this place. Of 
goals. Get to the crime scene. Meet, meet Deputy Thornton at the general store. Okay. You don't have a PlayStation 5 or anything here, just in case, for, on your free time, girl? Is that my daughter? Is that my husband? Mm-mm-mm. Just taking a look around, guys, just to see. Oh, my little kitchen, cute. Oh, my little tea, my, my cups. That looks cute. Very nice, very nice. All right, let's, let's take a look at the, all right, let's take a look at the board. And the map is right there, so. Everything we know about the previous murders. Worth taking another look. Okay, the case board is a mental technique that allows Saga to analyze clues and progress, progress the investigation. Use the right control stick to move around. Okay, and then use the L2 and R2 to zoom. Gotcha. That's it. You can use the left control stick to move the crowser. Okay. Uh, you are now free to investigate. Thank you. I was all like, can I look around, please? No, 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 no. Confidential. International dismission only. Can I look at it? The previous murders. Confidential. I can't read. Okay. Let's look over here. The previous murders. Looks like... This looks like... Oh. Let's see. A series of murders have been occurred around the town of Bright Falls. That's the name of the place. Finding the connections will help our search for the killer. Those look like wolf animal prints. Murder method. Slight difference in murders. Bloating only commonly in bodies, but not cause of death. Chest trauma. Exposure to water post Wait, what? Modern? Victims. All victims reported missing in 2010. No other... Okay. So these are the people that are missing? The victim was reported missing in 2010, discovered in 2012, buried in a shallow grave. Found in Cauldron Lake in 2018. Some organs missing. This is not what happened in the first game. State of the body does not match eight years spent in the lake. Oh, shit. Found two... Wait a minute. Found two weeks ago, chest wound was ruled as a cause of death. Tattooed on the body was eligible. What about these people? Oh, God. The two victims had... Some of the... From restraint, strapped or belt it down. Most recent victim died of a major chest, chest trauma consistent with 2018 victim. Hard to confirm due to the condition of the body. Bloating of the corpses. Wait, what? Drowning, but only one victim was found in water. And what happened in the intro, the person who we were playing as came out of the water, then afterwards they killed him. Why? They took out his heart and everything. Killer profile? Talk to someone? Oh. <clears throat> Victim number three was covered in tattoos message from the killer, maybe. Post for tattooing on the body. Apart from going missing in 2010, the victims have nothing apparent in common. Killer may be a sportsman or a hunter or a pikester. Hmm. Hmm. Wait, 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 should I download Alan Wake? I'd say go for it, um, Luffy. Wait, what does the mind palace... Wait, what is the mind place? It's, I guess it's where she can focus. <laughs> I don't know. It seems like she can go into her mind. Like, her mind is her office. So she can, like, investigate all this stuff. Uh, reread some of the documents, some of the stuff. You know, this is her mindset. This is her mind space. Her own office, I guess you could say. So how the hell do we get out of here? 
I'm done. It was your day off today? So then how was your day, Diego? Did you have a good day off? So when we go talk to him, we have to go to the general store and that's where we that's where the murder was. So wait a minute, this man that we were we were playing as Is that where it happened for real? We were close to the general store. We walked over here. Well, let's get to it, shall we? Wait, undiscovered. Oh, there's more to it to the map? Oh, good. I was like, this is a small map. We better have more areas to go to. Okay, looks like we have more areas to explore. Okay. You guys are crazy. You guys are such trolls. <laughs> now what? How do I get how do I get out of here? I don't want to think anymore. Slight difference in the murders voting only so then what do I do? What do I do? Drown the fan? Looks like we'll be adding more stuff. I'm done. I'm done. I want to go. I want to go talk to the man. How do I get out of here? Oh, duh. I see you're already hard at work, Anderson. Close to cracking it. We're just getting started. Let's head down the hill to the crime scene. Okay. Visiting the mine place does not. Hey, I wanted to read that shit. I'm a slow reader. Damn it. They should give you the option. Like if you're done reading, press X. It should do that for people like me, man. All right, let's go talk to the man. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> yes, it is. I think I'm thinking. Uh, doesn't pause time. Oh, okay. My place doesn't pause time. Be mindful and oh, of dangers nearby. Thank you, Omega. That's all it said. Oh, okay, so then. So that's good to know, because I thought, oh, maybe I could go into my mind, but then again, no. <laughs> You're not safe, you dumbass. Don't even think about it, Davis. If an enemy comes, don't think going to your mind. <laughs> hey, Casey. you putting me in charge. Why now? Look, Anderson, you're a better detective than I am. You've cracked cases that had the rest of us baffled. I don't want to slow you down. Are you thinking of retiring? You know what happens to cops who say this is their last case. Mm hmm Real funny, Anderson. Well, I expect your res res resignation paper on my desk today at 5 p.m. Chaos at Cauldron Lake, rampage of the rental cabins. Unidentified, unidentified man attacks vacationers in the dead of night, Sunday evening a barbecuing and late night fishing was violently disrupted saturday as a mysterious assailant attacked parked visitors causing chaos and destruction at the cabins the incident left the three people injured oh lord we have to read a lot no okay that the that the injured one of the, uh, one of which has been admitted to the country hospital, also the weather attacker is still at large. Bright Falls police have yet to make any official statement, leaving the local residents in a state of uncertainty. Uncertainty. Witnesses of the crime were visibly shaken, one of whom stated, One minute we were laughing and toasting some marshmallows, and the next we heard some, some screaming coming up from the cabins. We didn't know what was going on, so we called the police and started running for our lives in the opposite direction, said Kurt Mill. Another eyewitness who prefer wait preferred to remain anonymous said, "It's like he appeared out of nowhere. Suddenly, my dog starts barking his head off, and this psycho guy comes crashing through the trees. I don't think I'll ever feel safe in the forest again." Oh, a representative from the central cabins who 
chose to remain anonymous wanted to remain to remind customers if you have any plans to stay in our lovely cabins later this summer please get in touch with us as we may need to re-trigger some of the reservations based on the state of the cabin that you have rented with us as a representative went on further remind future and potential guests of the wonderful uh, what, what, what does it say I, I can't even read that that can be found in the other company's brochures and on the website which is real nice state of the art my nephew made it made it and he's a real computer whiz no i want to read no stop i want to read this a heartfelt reunion took place this weekend with mrs doubtfire i'm just kidding with miss wait what oh amanda smith was reunited with her beloved dog coffee bean cb oh my god cb again guys from silent hill short message uh, as his owner refers to him um has been missing for three days and mrs mrs smith was afraid that she would never see her best friend again when i got the call i couldn't believe my ears she said i must have asked am i dreaming at least seven or eight times <clears throat> It was actually nine times come from <laughs> Ranger uh, Stevenson, the man responsible for finding. Can you move that analog stick? We were. It's a oh, it's a it's wait, it's rare that you get to give. Wait, what? It's rare that you get to give those kinds of call. No, that you get to get those kinds of calls. And I feel real grateful to have had the opportunity. What with all the predators out there usually you're telling folks to that you found their dogs dead their cats eaten you know and so it felt real good to give some good news even if coffee bean is a kind wait, is in kind of rough shape oh no the fur will grow back sure but well i suppose that's all i should say about that oh okay uh does a hike a day keep depression away mm -hmm. Let's see about this. <clears throat> I might be bright, sunny. Wait, I might be bright, sunny July, but it's never too soon to start worrying about the gloomy months of autumn ahead. That's right. In the grand scheme of, of life, those dead, depressing days of those dead, depressing days are just around the corner. Have you been talking to, <laughs> have you been taking your vitamin D? Probably not. But for all, wait. But for all of you thinking, there's got to be another way. There's good news. Hiking has proven to be incredibly beneficial to your mental and emotional health. So get on out there. Get off your <laughs> just kidding. Get off your asses. And just don't forget a flashlight in case it gets too dark. Hey, keep reading, woman. Bright Falls own, wait, virtual baking champ? Bright Falls own... A uh, virtual baking champ. Little Sally Upton's whole family erupted into cheers, and then she won the big match this weekend. And she was playing. Wait, was she playing soccer, tennis? No. In this brave new world that we live in, her family was cheering her on as she won a match in a game that exists only in the information superhighway. The game in question was a Mega ba Baking Star in which players compete to make the tastiest treats and sweetest eats for their vi virtual judges online. Bright Falls congratulates Sally on her big win. Who gives a freak, man? I want to know what the hell is going on in this town. Talking about Sally baking some shit. <laughs> Nobody's tasted my brownies and nobody gives me compliments about it. I'll be back in a second. <laughs> I'm like leaving. I'm sorry. I need to investigate over here, sir. You want to start getting into hiking? I don't know where to go. Oh, anywhere, man. Uh, where I live? Oh, shit. Where I live, there's some pretty nice biking trails and some areas where... Actually, close by my where I live, uh, there's this park called... What is it called? There's Slaughter Park. I, freaky name, right? Slaughter Park. And there's another park. Oh, I forgot what it's called. Um, but uh, they're making it bigger, actually. And it's a very nice place to go walk. Me and my best friend, we used to go film there for my short films. I need bolt cutters. Belt cutters, you say? 
like Resident Evil. Wait, me is being. Oh, shut up. Having to shut up, Diego. My back hurts. My eyes are. So oh my God, Pikester, please. I'd say, I mean, they got a point there. Uh, oh, I keep pressing the wrong button. Hiking back, and walking Anderson. does help. It really does. It's good. It's good for to keep your body movement. Good to get your mind off things. I used to go walking around the the block. Starting fires is prohibited. You hear that, guys? Those of you who start campfires in a forest, you better watch yourself. The police are watching. Please do not feed the wildlife. Do not feed the, feed the wildlife, guys. Regardless of their hungry, don't give them your biscuits. Leave no trace. Wait, what? Oh. So I don't care if you're cold or whatever. You do not start a fire. Because if not, Smokey the Bear's gonna come out and beat you. Stairs ass. are out. You okay to jump down? I'm not that old. The stairs are out. Oh. Why don't you jump from here? <laughs> Wait a minute. Is this the trail to the mirror peak? Oh, for God's sakes, just show it to me. Mirror Peak, the mighty mountain in the distance is no other than Mirror Peak. Okay, did we ever go through there in the first game? I think we were close to it, maybe. The iconic landmark overlooking Cauldron Lake. From the right angle, its, beautifully will be ref wait, its beauty will be reflected on the calm surface of the lake, mirrored in all its inverted glory. Discrimination. Fucking nature. Hey! Gives me a headache. There's too much sky. Bitch! <laughs> what do you mean too much sky? When you step out of your house, like, what? Shh, do you have a giant roof still covering the sky or something? What planet are you from, fool? Oh, I keep pressing the wrong button. Hold on just a minute here. I'm going to look around over here. I think here. I saw something. It'll only take a minute. I'll wait here. Oh, look, look, look. What's this? What's this, guys? What's this? Wait, where are we? Where am I going? I'm sorry, that, that's just me. I'm always like, another one. I'm always like going in a different Is direction a than- Kids What's... lunchbox? Oh. An Alex Casey movie lunchbox. Casey hates the endless jokes about coincidentally having the same name as a fake detective. <laughs> he hates those cheesy crime books, but he really hates the movies. Okay. Manuscript fragments, manuscript fragments. My dad used to say, when the going gets tough, the tough get going. Not sure where the tough get going to, but maybe you'll find find it inspiring. When the when the going gets tough, the tough get going. Alex Casey. Manuscript fragments can be used to up wait, can be used to upgrade weapons in the mine place? Again and again, hold the fire button to activate. I don't even have a gun, do I? I should have a gun. I'm an FBI. Increases the rate. Should I do it? Oh, I don't even have enough. I barely got two. More bullets. Increases the magazine size by 50%. Another headshot. Land two headshots in a quick succession to stun the enemy for an extended duration. Hmm. Well. He lives in the sewers. <laughs> well, 
well, interesting. There's a whole different way to play this game than the first one. Well, you see, the benefits of exploring. All right, well, I guess I'll go back. I need to get, what is this? More star falls. This powerful feature of nature will revive the spirit as it does the surrounding nature. The turner, uh, wait, turnering, grinding waters at the bottom of the falls resemble a Molter and pistol quite like the one in which, wait, which a cauldron lake is fabled to have used to travel through the night sky. <gasps> Maybe we're going to get more information about Bright Falls and why and what and how did the lake become so enchanted? How it was able to bring certain things that these writers would write about come to life. Oh! Oh, it's you! Did you get lost, Anderson? Not a bad place to get murdered. Hmm. <laughs> Getting back to nature is your thing. Not a bad bad place to get murdered. <laughs> I might bring, might bring some around. of my victors here. See you in a bit. Take your time. Oh, thank you, sir. Yeah, because I'm the type of woman that likes to explore everything. If I'm going to become a detective, I have to look at every nook and cranny. I need to find all the evidence. But I swear to God, if this girl, if this is how you run. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, I no, you can't go there. Back. Oh. I was saying, if this is how you really run, girl, this, if. Shit. I'm so tired of these morning jogs. Even Alan Wake had a faster run than you. He had a terrible stamina, though. <gasps> Dude! So, do you follow me or what, sir? Upgrades things in your mind. Reality doesn't even get affected by imagination, but you can per you could pretend these blanks are extra bullets. <laughs> Damn. Should have brought an umbrella. I like oh. the rain. The only thing around here that feels like home. You think wait, the wait. local law had the sense to put up a tarp? Hmm. If they did, next coffee's on me. Wait, 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 wait. So you like rain, but you don't like the sky. I guess you like it when it's cloudy, is that what you mean? You don't want to see the blue sky. Sir, are you ready to retire soon? I think you should. <laughs> He's a water bender, not an air bender. Well, I'm, I'm about to fire bend his ass. That sounds so bad. <laughs> Never mind. I'm about to fire bend. <laughs> that sounds. I should tell my friends. What? General Star. No, no fire burnage. Oh, yeah, we can't cause any fire in the forest. Shit. Well, this is a nice looking scene right here. General store, cauldron lake. Hey! Hey! How's it going, sir? Deputy Thornton, I take it. That's me, at your service, ready to get this case solved. Now, the body's behind the store. Come on, I'll show you. Excuse me just a moment, sir. Oh. oh. The FBI, huh? That's so cool. Hunting down psycho serial killers and shootouts with the mob. You forgot the UFO cover-ups. What? Those uh. are real? <laughs> you guys hiring? For oh, my God. Let's just see this body. Shall we? Give me one second, gentlemen. I need to make sure I look at everything around here. I am uh, an FBI af after all. I must look at every nook and cranny. I wonder if we're going to have time to look at everything. Because uh, I'm only following the road, but I haven't gone... 
Are these important? I don't think so. A lunchbox again. A lunchbox again? Who's leaving these out here? Does it have Doritos? Menu fragments, only one. Remember, it's just as bad. It's just a bad day, not a bad life. Hmm. But if you're having a good day, ignore this whole thing. Hmm. Remember, it's just a bad day, not a bad life. Well, good thing I came to explore. Right? It's that's a good that's a good saying. I swear to God, she better when the moment comes where we have to run away, she better like haul ass. She better run. I hate these morning jog runs. It's like why are they putting that in every horror game that you play? Most of these characters have like these morning jogs. Like what the hell? Oh, can I explore here for a little bit? You can use to activate Saga's flashlight. So your name is Saga? What's this? Monday. Some suspicious activity spotted. The filter thought that we he saw movement in the bushes. Footprints around the area were found, but some were compromised by the fielder. Note to self, train the fielder. Thursday, nothing to report. Some animals regu regular. Wednesday, hunters are out, hunters out after dark. Poachers heard some gunshots. Not, the, not of ours. Got to keep an eye out on those people. They could get more than they bargain for out there. <laughs> Shut up. It's not a good life. It's just a bad day. <gasps> what are these? Oh, maybe it's a good thing we're exploring, guys. Maybe because we're picking up evidence. We're picking up clues. I mean, I don't know what the fuck this is. Oh, look, Deerfest. Remember that? Remember that? If you open up! Oh. Come on, girl, kick it. Can I push this? I can't push it? Well, damn. That's kind of limited. And Alan Wake, anything you touch, or, or sh you could push in almost anything. Well, I think I'm done here, folks. How do I turn off my flashlight? There we go. Okay. All right. Sorry, gentlemen. Let's continue. Show us a dead body. Show us the poor son of a bitch. Actually, hold on, gentlemen. <laughs> I need to investigate. <clears throat> Dude. Just go to the main objective. I'm so, I, Oh. For this. Wait, I'm going to have to watch the... For now, I need to sleep. All right, Omega. Hey, thanks so much for stopping by. Hope you have yourself a good night's sleep, sir. Pleasant dreams, and we'll see you next time. Okay. I kind of want to go explore, guys, but at the same time, I, maybe I should just stick to my objective. Should I go explore? Should I go explore? I'm going to go explore. Gentlemen, I'll be right back. We might find some more lunch boxes. Maybe one of them would have like a chocolate frosted donut. Huh? Can't go any further. Okay. Water's okay, okay. too deep.
What's that? What's that? Batteries? I can't go that way. But, and look, more of those. I wonder if we have to shoot them down or something. Well, unfortunately, I already run out of time for this episode of Alan Wake 2 because I spent too long. Yes, Cyber, I spent too long exploring, but we'll see what happens in the next one. Hopefully, yeah. Well, for sure, we're going to have to go investigate the dead body. But this will be it for the first episode of my gameplay of Alan Wake 2. So far, it's, you know, it's a little slow pacing at the moment, but maybe hopefully later on when we get to the good stuff, it'll get good. <clears throat> Oh, are you cyber? What are you going to get? But so for my viewers on Twitch who are watching me live, stay tuned, guys, because we just got started with this adventure of Alan Wake 2. And we're going to see we're going to keep on going and we're going to see what happens next. And for my viewers on YouTube, they'll be watching this sometime in the future. Thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, sorry, not much. Not that much happened. But like I said, hopefully things will start to pick up later on. But I appreciate you watching my video, uh, my gameplay of this game. And we'll see you in the next episode, hopefully. Take care. Have a good day or a good night. And also, just in case, if those of you who would be interested in checking out my Twitch channel, the link to that will be in the description below this video. Just click on the link, and it'll bring you straight here. All right, guys. Take care, everybody. Laters.